the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. So for today's video, I'm going to help this noob with second C using the bump fruit. Yes, guys, the bump fruit. But before that, I made a Twitter account for future announcements and giveaways. So make sure to follow it. Next up, guys, to show your support, you can use the star code Gamer Nom when buying your Robux. Okay, guys, so are you ready to join me in this journey in helping this noob with second C? Okay, so let's go. Let's eat this bomb fruit. So first, we're gonna start with the bandits. We're gonna lure five and use our first skill. We only have two skills, guys. <laughs> that skill is the snipe. So, guys, make sure to aim properly because again, if you don't use your snipe properly, your enemies will go flying around this area. Okay, so there you go. The goal here is to reach level 10. So, and that's it. We can now move on to our next island, which is the jungle. So here, we're gonna start with the monkeys. So guys, just remember how you defeated the bandits. That's the same. So here, we're gonna lure three. Go, and again, defeat them using the snipe. So you're gonna need to do this twice. Defeat six twice to finish a quest. Guys, if you finish two quests, you will reach level 17. The requirement for your next quest is level 15, the gorillas. But again, guys, if you finish two quests, you'll reach 17, which is really fine. So next up, the gorillas. And by this time, we've already unlocked the second skill, the ultimate explosion. I'm gonna show it to you. There you go. Not the best skills, but guys, we can work this out. So you need to learn four. There you go, and use your skills to defeat them. Okay, so again, you need to defeat 8 to finish a quest. Even with just one quest, you will be able to level up and reach level 20. So guys, at level 20, we all know we can start our first quest, first mini boss quest, the Gorilla King quest. So Gamer Nam, is he hard to defeat because we only have two skills? No, he's easy to defeat. Again, our friend is the high ground, but avoid doing this. When you're using your X skill, make sure to create distance so that you won't get damage. This skill is kind of long range. So there you go. So again, go back to the gorillas or do server hop. You keep on defeating the gorilla king. The goal here is to reach level 30. Okay. There you go. So when you reach level 30, we are now ready to move on to our next island. And that island is the pirate village. So here, we're gonna start with the pirates. We're gonna need to defeat eight. So lure four pirates. You can lure four pirates at a time, but you will only need to do it twice to finish a quest. The same goes, use your snipe and your ultimate explosion. But guys, I suggest always use your ultimate explosion first. The goal here is to reach level 40. Yeah, we reach 41. And after that, we can now proceed to our next mob, the brutes. So you need to defeat 10 brutes. You can lure five at a time. This is easier so that you only need to do this twice to finish a quest. Oh, there you go. They're kind of tanky to be honest, but it's fine, guys. Patience is the key to success. You're gonna need to do it twice again, the luring, to level up. Guys, at level 55, you can start defeating uh, they call this Bobby. Yeah, the mini boss in this island, and he's here. Just dodge the skill, use your Z skill. Okay, use your X skill. After that, make sure to dodge, dodge, dodge. There you go, and everything will be fine. There you go. Again, the goal here is level 60, and after that, off to our next island, the desert. Here, we're gonna start with the desert bandits. You need to defeat eight, right? So here we go, lure four. There are only four here, so lure them all. Okay, defeat them. You're gonna need to do this twice. Go. I think three sets of skills. Okay, so do this twice to level up. Everything's easy and kind of repetitive. Next target, Desert Officers. They're located here at 75. There you go. You can lure four and three at a time to finish the quest. Oh, no, no, no. You only need six, right? Okay, six. So, there you go. Guys, we're gonna level up here until we reach level 105. Stat check 86 melee. 
83 defense, 146 block speed. So guys, at 105, you can now go to the Frozen Village. And before you grind, go to the cave, buy the Geppo, buy the Buso, and buy the Zoro. So guys, the reason why 105, because I want to start here with the Yeti. Guys, the Yeti is here. So again, same strategy with the Gorilla King. Maintain your distance so that you can use your skills. There you go. Dodge, dodge. After that, you can go to the Snow Bandits. You need to defeat 7, right? So lure 5 at the time because there's 5 here. Or you can lure 4 if you want. If you use your snipe, make sure that they're near the walls so that they won't go flying around and defeat them. The goal here is to reach level 130 and if ever you have a chance to defeat the Yeti, go for it. So once you reach level 130, stat check first. 111 melee defense, 168 blocks fruit. For our next island, we have the Marine Fortress. So here we're gonna start and end with the Vice Admiral. So guys, again, remember uh, the clown, Bobby. So same strategy, attack, dodge, wait for it to attack, there you go. Attack, dodge, dodge, wait for it to attack. And guys, that's easy. Guys, we're gonna level up here until we reach level 225. Why? I'm gonna explain it to you now. So there you go. Why 225? I'm gonna show you the experience that you will get. 350,000 with the Vice Admiral. So our next mob is the Sky Bandits, right? In the Skylands, you'll only get 250,000. Okay, so Vice Admiral wins. We're just gonna do server hop. The gamer know how about the next mob, the Dark Masters? Guys, Dark Masters will only give you same experience as the Vice Admiral. So I suggest just focus here with the Vice Admirals and just do server hop, okay? So let's say we reach 225 stat check, 206 mil defense, 263 blast fruits. Next up, the Coliseum. Okay, so here we're gonna start with the Toga Warriors. You need to defeat seven. So what I'm doing here is I lure four at a time. If you can, just lure four and three. The goal here is to reach seven, defeat seven, I mean. Gamer yeah, why three? Usually you lure four. Because guys, I only need to unlock two skills. I don't need the mastery. But a master increases damage, but it's fine, guys. Okay, so goal here is to reach level 275. And after that, you can now move on to your next target, the gladiators. So here, same strategy, lure 4. It's just that they're kind of far away. So you need to be really extra patient to finish this part. There you go. They're so far. Defeat them. Guys, lure them in the middle, okay? Because some might go back to their spawn points. There you go. Okay, so goal here is to defeat 8, right? And then the goal level is 300. But let me just defeat this first. I'm gonna show you an area where you can level up. It really depends on you if you wanna capitalize on that. So there you go. After this, you can go to this island or, or a prison. It's called a prison. So why I showed you, guys, you're gonna need this later. So we have three mini bosses here. First is the swan. So this will uh, give you an uh, we call this level up, instant level up. But the other bosses, like this one, the Warden, I don't know. The experience is kinda low. Chief Warden, uh, I think it's decent experience. So there you go, guys. Remember this area. But if you want, you can just finish it in the Gladiators. So next island, we have the Magma Village. So here, guys, we have two mobs. But we're just gonna focus here with the military soldiers. You need to defeat nine. So lure five at a time. Guys, yes, you can lure them. Just make sure to assemble them all in the middle, which is the landmark is the bridge. There you go. So make sure to attack them here because they might go back to respawn points if you don't do that. So there you go, guys. The goal here is to reach level 375. We're gonna skip the military spice because they're hard to defeat because of their Soru. There you go. But before that, guys, before we move on to our next island, you can level up faster when you reach level 350 because you can defeat the Magma Admiral here. So Magma Admiral, just dodge that skill. There you go, use your skill. And as you can see guys, I'm already preparing my combat. Because I'm gonna use the Z skill of combat, there you go, just so that it won't regenerate its HP. So you want to damage him from time to time, so we're gonna need some help from the combat. Only the quick tackle is enough. So there you go guys, dodge, use your skill. Oh, I almost died there. I'll 
I thought he's dead with that skill. So there you go. 375 stat check, 301 melee defense, blast foot 526. So for our next city, it's a city, underwater city. There you go, it's located here. We're gonna start in the end with the Fishman Warriors. Again, guys, you need to defeat eight. So lure four at a time. There you go, one, two, three, and four. Use your skills. Guys, you need to be fast here. See that I always get hit. When you use your X skill, make sure to use it fast and then start dodging. For example, this one. X and dodge, 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 dodge. Okay. Same goes for the snipe. Just use it. Z, aim, boom. Okay. Don't wait for them to attack you. Okay. This will be useful later on our next upcoming fights. So there you go, guys. The goal here is to reach level 450 to make things faster at level 400 or 425. Yeah. You can start defeating the Fishman Lord. So how do you defeat him? Guys, wait for him to use that skill and use your skills. One or two skills is enough. Make sure to use your combat so that his HP won't regenerate and that's it. Okay, use that skill. Time to use all your skills. Okay? Okay, guys. Okay, let's defeat this first. Boom. Okay. Again, 450 is our target level. Now we are ready to go to the Skylands. Remember that we did not train here a while ago. We're gonna go a step higher. We're gonna start with the God's Guards. So guys, as you can see, uh, the Fishman Lord gives out more experience, but level up here is faster. Okay, faster. Why? Because the mobs here, I really like this area to level up. So you can lure four, defeat them, lure three, to finish a quest. The goal here is search level 525. Guys, the enemies here jump, so there's a small chance that they will get stuck. Again, the goal here is level 525. There we go. Oh, I almost forgot there's a boss here. The Whisper at 500, you can start defeating him. Do server up using this, it's fine. Just dodge that cannon. And dodge again. There you go, dodge, dodge. Wait for him to use it. Because guys, being hit by that cannon is kind of fatal, to be honest. The damage is high, but it's easy to dodge. Dodge, dodge, there you go, use your skill. Boom, and that's it. Moving on, we're gonna start here with the Royal Squads. Right, Royal Squads. We're gonna lure four. You have five here if you want to go for five, just four, and defeat them. Guys, the goal here is to reach level 575. Why 575? Because at that level, we're gonna unlock the requirement to fight the mini boss here at 575. And that boss is the Thunder God NL. Yo, Thunder God. If I'm gonna be honest, this boss is easier compared to the Magma. Yes. And the Fish Lord. So, yeah. Just dodge that skill and use all your skills. And that's it. Okay, oh. We got the Pope. Well, anyway, guys. You can go back to the guards or uh, server hop, right? Until you reach level 625. Okay, okay. So now, oh, use the combat. Check that mastery out. So at 625, we can now move on to our final island, which is the Fountain City. So here, guys, we're gonna start with the galley pirates. We're not gonna fight the galley captains because they have hockey, which is, uh, it doesn't matter because we're not using Logia, but they're so far apart. There you go, just lure. Guys, remember the uh, Fishman Warriors? You need to use your skills fast, okay? Because they will really hit you. There you go. So the goal here is to reach level 700. But guys, to make things faster, you can start defeating the Cyborg at 675. This is the mini boss in this island, and here it is. Guys, you need to really dodge this skill. And then after you use your skill, just dodge, dodge, dodge. There you go. Guys, don't be hasty here. Make sure to make him use his skill first. And you can also use your uh, combat Z skill. And after that, guys, you reach 700, you will have a quest. And this quest will ask you to go to the prison. Guys, stat check 430 mil defense, 1240 in the blast pool. Guys, remember the prison that I told you a while ago? You're gonna need to go here, talk to the military detective. He will then ask you to go to the frozen village. Okay. So in the frozen village, again guys, remember the cave? Here it is. Just go, there's a door here, you can use the key that the detective gave you and you need to fit this one, the Ice Admiral. Just make sure to save here, just in case you get defeated. There you go. So after this, 
go back to the prison and then they will ask you to go to the middle town and you will now have a permission to go to the second sea again look for the experience captain here it is here go okay so here we go guys second sea so guys what do you think everything is possible with just patience right and perseverance so again guys update december 30 two or three days from now again to all the viewers subscribers supporters i appreciate you all for more recommendations or suggestions just comment it on the comment section again this is gamer and gamer out